As big of a requirement Logitech's G Hub software is, it can be a nightmare to use at times. My name is Yadullah. You are watching Candidate Technology, and in this video, we are talking about how you can fix the Logitech G Hub software not launching. Now, G Hub is Logitech's proprietary program, but a lot of people complain that it doesn't work fine or it doesn't launch in the first place. Now, the easiest method to fix uh, G Hub not launching is to just open Task Manager by right clicking the Windows menu icon and then clicking on Task Manager. And now uh, in the Processes tab, uh, we're going to find G Hub. So, as you can see, I have two G Hub processes running. I am going to close both of them. So, G Hub Agent and G Hub Updater. And then check the list to make sure that no other G Hub processes are running. This is paramount for this method to work. You need to close it down completely. As you can see, G Hub has automatically launched itself again. And that's because I'm currently using a Logitech mouse that requires the software to run in order to be able to use those profiles. So, but regardless, if I end this task again, end this task again, go back and then launch G Hub. Um, it should take a while to open up, but it should open up just fine. And as you can see, it's initializing everything, loading resources. We'll give it a second. And yep, G Hub is working as expected. If uh, completely restarting GHub has not fixed the problem, your best bet is to go ahead and reinstall the program. Now to do that, you can either check out our uninstall GHub video or uh, I'll just quickly show you how to do it. So right click the start menu, head over to installed apps. And before you start this process, uh, just make sure you have closed GHub. So um, right click the system tray icon right here. Let me just move my camera so that you can see it clearly. Yeah, right click this icon right here, head over to G Hub, right click and then select quit. Now, once G Hub has been shut down, we will find G Hub in this list. So let's just search for it. That'll be easier. Search so for Logitech, I found Logitech G Hub. Click these three dots, head over to uninstall. It will give you a warning. Click uninstall again. Once it's done, head over to Logitech's website to download the client again, reinstall it, and your error should be gone. If you like these videos, consider subscribing, give us a thumbs up, press the bell icon, and tell us in the comments below if you have any thoughts on this video or if there's any other content that we can make for you. If you want to know more about tech, visit our website, candid.technology, follow us on social media, follow me on Instagram or Twitter, and we'll see you in the next video.